How to add a calendar to your Joomla site using JEvents. Events Calendar, also known as JEvents, is a well-liked calendar extension for Joomla. As with all extensions we'll be showing you, start by going to extensions.joomla.org. Then, navigate to the Calendars and Events, Events category, and find the Events Calendar page. Click Download. Open the Files tab. For maximum functionality, it's recommended that you install all of the extensions listed here, as we will. The only thing that's required, though, is the component. If you need assistance with finding or installing extensions, watch the first two tutorials in this series. Once all packages have been installed, go to Components. Then, go to JEvents MVC. After it sets up the database, click Continue. Next, you will be directed to verify that the configuration is correct. The defaults should work just fine for our purposes. Glance over the settings in every tab and change whatever you want, then scroll right. Click Save. A default calendar and category should have already been created for you. Let's add an event. Click New. Type a subject for the event. Select a category to place it in. Adjust anything else you want on this page, then proceed to the Calendar tab. Set a start and end date. If this is a repeating event, select the correct repetition interval. Scroll right. Click Save. Let's enable the Search plugin for this component. Extensions. Plugin Manager. Scroll down and locate the correct plugin. If necessary, click Next. Click the X to enable this search plugin. Next, let's add this extension to our site. Go to Menus. Choose the menu you want to contain a link to the calendar. Scroll right. Click New. Select JEvents MVC. There are a number of views that you can choose for this component. We'll choose Monthly Calendar. Enter a title. Open the component parameters and scroll right. You'll need to specify at least one event category using the select boxes here. Choose the one our event is in. Scroll up. Click Save. Now, enable and rearrange the module's instances that were created automatically when we installed the four modules. Go to Extensions. Then, Module Manager. Enter JEvent here to display only those modules we're looking for. Press Go. Click here to select all the modules listed below. Then, click Enable. The first module displays a mini-calendar. Let's make some more changes to it. Click here. Change the title, if you want. 
Click No to hide the title. Alter the position, then the order. Scroll down. Change the menu assignment to ensure this module only shows up on the home page. Click Home. Scroll back up. Click Save. On your own, place the next module underneath the previous one in the same fashion. Repeat with the final two modules, this time placing them both in the left column on the calendar page only. When finished, go check out the changes we made to the site. Click Preview. Here's the calendar link we made. Scroll down and right. The first two modules show up correctly here, too. Click View Full Calendar. And here's the calendar itself. Notice that the event we made shows up here. Scroll down and left. The legend and theme switcher both show up where we placed them. This is the end of the tutorial. You now know how to add a calendar to your Joomla site using JEvents.